Well, you guys got another video here for you in this one we're going to be looking at windows 10 monitoring data usage uh, tool that's built into windows 10 and i'm going to be showing you also how to reset those uh, numbers back to zero so let's take a look at what we're looking at here we're going to go to the start button and then hit settings once the settings panel is open we need to go to where it says network and internet click on that and you can see there that we have an overview of our data usage so if you wanted to look at more in-depth uh, usage you can have a look at usage details and this will then list all the items that I've been using your network usage here and you can see the system is using the majority of it we've got OneDrive so if you have if you're a OneDrive user and you're a heavy user of it then you will get a high usage here as you can see there's not much listed here because it's on a virtual machine but if you had a load of listed stuff here you can then monitor what is zapping all your network usage and we all know that we've got caps and data usage uh, that we have to uh, abide by by our ISPs so you can see here this is how you can monitor what's using the most so again it doesn't make it very easy when you want to reset these figures as you can see this is just for Ethernet you'd have Wi-Fi up here as well uh, and uh, whatnot if you was using those as well um, but if you wanted to reset this it's not as simple as just hitting a reset button because it doesn't have one so what we're going to do is show you how to do it so first off we're going to close this off and uh, we're going to come down to the uh, search area here I'm going to type in here MS config and we're going to open up the system configuration once we've got this open um, we want to go to where it says uh, boot and we want to go into safe boot okay and once we're in there we can then uh, change the settings because you can't uh, delete the uh, data uh, without being in safe mode at the moment I mean a batch file might be able to do that but you'd have to configure that first um, so let's just uh, restart the system and this should take us straight into uh, safe mode okay so now you can see we are in safe mode and what we want to do here is now we're in safe mode um, we want to go to the start button here we're going to go to right click and then file explorer and then we're going to go to the C drive so we need to go to this PC and then the C drive then Windows then we'll come down to where it says system 32 which is here and then we're going to come down to uh, SRU click that and what you need to do here is you need to delete everything inside here okay once you've deleted all that contents in that folder we can then reboot the system now we need to take the tick out of uh, the MS config so we can go back to the normal desktop so we're going to right click on the start button here and we're going to go to run and we're going to type in there MS config just like this click OK and this will open up our system configuration here go back to boot here and we're going to take the tick out of safe boot apply that and OK and restart the system and there we are back at the desktop now what we need to do now is quickly go to the start button here and then hit settings then we can go back to network and internet and as you can see all that data has now been reset now it's a bit of a pain I know there's other ways of monitoring your uh, network usage uh, or your data usage uh, but this is just the, the Windows way and it's a bit of a nightmare to reset it but that's how you can reset all your data usage and put it back to zero so anyway, so I hope this one helps you out. My name is Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. If you enjoy these videos, guys, then hit that like button. Also, hit the subscribe button if you want to keep up to date when I upload new videos. If you've got any problems with your computers or any questions or any reviews you want me to do, then head over to my forums. The information's on the screen. And also, if you haven't joined my Facebook fan page, then you can uh, head over there and give us a little like up over there as well. So thanks again for watching. Bye for now.